Look at the size of this mystery Funko Grail box. Yes, it's huge. We've not had one of these in such a long time, guys. Join us as we unbox six of these mystery Funko Grail boxes from Pop Figures. So do not go anywhere. Hi everyone, how are we doing? Welcome back to Demise Family YouTube channel. The home of all things geek. Yes! Thank you so much for tuning in. If you like us and you love mystery boxes, collectibles, Funko Pops, then you are definitely in the right place because it's Mystery Grail Funko Pop Lottery! Woo! Well, it could be. Let's take a close look at what is on offer because there's a lot of good mega heavy hitters in this box and possible other ones that are actually listed in it as well. Mm-hmm. So it's $5.99 a box and it's limited to 300 boxes. So it's a good price. It is, 300 is quite a small run as well compared to other mystery boxes that mm -hmm. come out. Uh, we did buy six of them, that was the limit because we thought we'd really go for it this time as well. The number one mega hitter was Metallic Dumbo. Yeah. Disney. And there's also the um, Moon Knight special. Dumbo, 480 pieces, which is tiny. Wow, yeah. So that's a showstopper, that one. And then they've got the Moon Knight, which is big now with it coming out. So that's the yeah. LACC, which I think is Los Angeles Comic Con yeah. 2017, which at the time can't have been that big. It wasn't. I remember when the Moon Knight pop came out because I think we had it as well. Yeah. Not the special edition. Now they've but got it coming yeah. on to. Uh, on the old telly. D Disney Plus. Yeah. And it does look really good if anyone's seen yeah, the trailer. Yeah, we've seen the trailer. We've not seen the episode number one yeah, yet. But. Saving that for Sunday evening, aren't we? Yeah. So this did actually arrive a few days ago. We're just a little bit late filming it. So we're going to do it now and show you guys. Another top here. Uh, we don't collect Freddy Funkos, but Freddy Funko. Pennywise Freddy Funko. Oh. Funko. Oh. Yeah. Not hey. a fan of Pennywise clowns, but it is a really cool figure. I like that one. No? No. No. Uh, who else is in it? Is that everyone that I can think of that they listed? I, don't know. I think they've got they've like got um, the smaller hits, which are like twenty pounds. So you're still getting a good profit on your six pound uh, box yeah, price. Yeah, the so TPD value good. is above six pound. Condition as well, eight point five or above, or eight point five or above. Yeah, that's really good. That's yeah. pretty cool. So you're not going to get no yeah. knocks about pops. Where? Well, I'm an out of the box collector anyway. I know you're like, <laughs> you're not. You've got to get them out and look at them. They're special and they're expensive. Yeah, then, so. understandable. If it's a mega rare pop, you're not going to open it and I'll pay you. No. And ruin the box. I'm, I'd be silly to do that. I wouldn't do that with a mega rare one. So, it's massive. I imagine maybe come in protectors or the cardboard sorters because it was only $6.99. So, that would be asking maybe a bit too much. Yeah. I haven't bought a pop figures box in such a long time. Ah! I love that it comes printed on there now as well. Because last time when we used to order them, it never had the screen printed design. So that is a nice touch. And the tape as well. That's how long it's been. There's no other way of doing this, Beth. Apart from like this. Ah! All right, Hulk. Do you want to do the honors? Pull the strip. Pull the strip. That's it. In we go. Ooh. Let's have a look. That's what's inside, guys. Mega packed with bubble wrap. Bump. Pillows as well. I like the little boxes. The little yeah. sorters. Lovely yeah. little touch. Also, they, they are in the hard... Well, not the hard hard cases, but they've got their own plastic yeah. hard cases. Standard protectors. I didn't yeah. think they'd be in these. It would well, be in 6 they, they have their own, don't they? they? They've made their own, so... Yeah, they do, they've but... they've got the indent yeah. in them. The pops they sell online are 8 99 with a protector. Uh. What have we got? Artemis Files from Disney. I, I don't know even what it is. No idea. Uh, not had... it's it's in the slightest. Oh, it, it is, is a, a chase. Chase, chase from Cup Pop. That is pretty nice. Nowadays, chases aren't very rare though, because the one in six. Yeah. OG days. One in thirty-six when a chase was like. Well, it depends on how big the run is, on how crazy big to get the chase is. So. Yeah, I suppose so. Let's take a close look at him anyway. Artemis Fowl. Is that right? Artemis Fowl. I no idea so. what it is. <laughs> it looks pretty cool. The normal version of him is without the glasses, and the chase is with the glasses. Let's take a closer look at the back now. Other well, characters on there: Holly Short and Mulch Diggins. 
okay. no idea. That's not one for keepers for us, so we won't be keeping that. That's up for trade or swapsies. Well, same Ooh, thing. Oh, we've got stickers too. Stickers. Cool. Got stickers. Get rid of that. Cheekers so we've got. We've actually got three each. Should we get those out? One. Okay. You've got two left because you've already opened one already. And I'll get mine out. Hey. Yoki. Signature jelly beans as well. Thank you. Only one bag though. One order, so one bag. These are mine. Mine. Right, I'm gonna let's have a little box off competition, shall we? Okay. But the well, the, if we get a good hit, then it's a good figure. If we get a figure that goes with our collection, which we probably won, this is what happens in a mystery box. Then it's a hit as well, I guess. I guess so. so any Marvel, any Star Wars, any. Like, we don't know if Artemis is a hit or not because we haven't seen it yet. Yeah, it we could haven't be. got through enough of Disney Plus yet. We're very yeah. behind. For some people, that could be a good hit. So, I'm going to let you guys at home first see what's in my first one. Oh, why are you guys? I didn't I'm only look doing it with this first. One. I right. gave the front. <laughs> Ready? Quick fire one. Ah! What we got, guys? Anything good? Am I going to be loving it or hating it? Let's have a look. Prince! Ooh, diamond, diamond Prince! Ooh! That's quite good, I suppose. We do have a diamond. Elton John. <laughs> Elton John, which we get out at Christmas. This is not really a Christmas pop, but Prince. Prince is pretty cool. Yeah, and a diamond version. So. I am actually happy with that and could possibly keep that. I mean, just look at him. Let's take a closer look in his super glittery, shiny purple jacket. He's even got glittery hair. Glittery hair. Oh, <laughs> no. Closer look. It is happening. A closer look. Yeah? Okay. Quick closer look. Be nice. I'm going to be nice. Quick fire nice. Oh, it comes with a stand as well. I love pops that come with a stand. I personally feel all pops should come in the stand because half the time they do not stand up whatsoever. And you the worst is Jack Skeleton. He has the oh. tiniest feet and he doesn't come with a stand. It's ridiculous. Yeah. Or females. It's really rough. Have a feel. The glitter's coming off, Ooh. actually. It's like sandpaper. Yeah. But even his hair's glittery. And his guitar. His guitar's glitter, white <laughs> glitter, 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 the suit, even the pink trousers. I mean, wow. So, yeah. <laughs> Glittery hell. <laughs> it's, it's that glittery. It's all over his face. It's literally everywhere. And his eyes glittery. And everything. Oh. So yeah, very nice. That's a lot of glitter. I think. Oh, even on the stand he falls over. So there you go. I put him on properly, and then he won't fall over. Get in there. <laughs> oh man, pops. They're just so top heavy, aren't they? They don't think about the feet. That's why I like action figures more. And they're much better made too, to be honest. Right, I'm giving up with that. I'm just going to lie him down. So it's there you have it. comes with a stand, but not great that he doesn't yeah. stand on the stand. That's Funko for you, I'm afraid. Okay. Ready? Three, two, one. Okay. Anything good? I don't know. I can't see yet. Another oh, Jace. no. Is that? Yes. It's, yeah. This is that one. literally goes yeah. for about... So that's a standard what? price pop. Six quid, yeah. Yeah, I imagine it will be. It's so bad. Even though it's a chase, it's not a red chase at all. This is a nice figure, and your first one is a nice figure as well. Don't know what that one's worth. We're not going to unbox that and take a closer look unless you no. want to. Sir. No. So I'm behind. I need to hurry up, don't I? I need to get my other one out and see what's Hello, going on. I've got the rubbish ones now. You're winning. The right. stand is here. Keep the stand. Keep that safe. <laughs> but yeah, what uses a stand that doesn't even work? <laughs> Number two. Let's have a look. If you win again, I'm, I'm just going to walk off. <laughs> Viewers will know what I'm into and like, so you will know at home first if it's going to be any good. Ooh, it's a Harry Potter one. Crimes of Grindelwald. Cool though. Finestral. What like even is? I can't remember it. They're a mythical creature, but they kind of look like a bony 
flying horse kind yeah. of thing. <laughs> it does look pretty strange. Taking a closer look at it, I mean, it does look cool. It's got a, it's got a cool shape to it and the ears. It looks like a like demonic cat. Oh, it's a weird. bird. The demonic bird, some kind of crazy. Yeah, but kind of like if you killed a phoenix. What? <laughs> mm. Yeah. Well, it's a fantastic beast, so it needs to be weird and different anyway, doesn't it? For that, I think. Mm -hmm. So it's all right. I've not had a bad pull yet. I wouldn't consider those bad pulls. You've had two chases so far. Two. Yeah, but they're poopy chases. They are poopy chases, but still two. Okay. Last one. Come on. No mega hits. Please. What we got? Oh, it's Terminator Sarah Connor. Sarah Connor. Okay, I lose. <laughs> Let's, let's have a look at the pop. No. <laughs> Beth not being a Terminator fan. I like the original. I watched it up to like, well, I didn't watch it up to this one, put it that way. T2 was as far as it went for me, I think. Sarah Connor. I don't know how far you can take the Terminator films, really. Yeah, that's in the poopy pile for me. Free poopy pops, really. Yeah, just call by side the poopy pile. But you got two chases, don't forget that. Last one. Poop chases. Let's try and get one of those 20 pound hits. The, the, that one could be, but I might be wrong, because some glitter pops are still quite cheap anyway, aren't mm -hmm. they? It was a big run for it. I'm going to open this one first. We are going to open this one together. <laughs> You're Pretty trying to like make it better for me how bad my pops are. Yes, we bought them, we deserve it. We bought six, so we did We did try and win. you got to be in it to I win it. I bought six and you didn't get there in time. you got to be in it to win it, guys. I was in it. You ready? Mm-hmm. Hey. What the? What? Oh, no! Uh. Uh. Dirty Dancing. That guy from Dirty Dancing. Not my scene. I appreciate it. it was a cool iconic film. What was his name? I don't know. He just sleeps with small children in it. That's all I know. It's oh kind dear. of creepy and yeah. <laughs> There is a very nice dancing scene in it, but for me it's not my <laughs> film. And it's not I prefer the Yeah, that one's definitely not keeping. The only one I'm probably gonna keep is Prince, just because it's Prince. You know, get down with Alphabet Street. Dog going crazy. What do you think? Please let us know in the comments section and let us know if you got any top hits as well. I've not been looking on social media, so I don't know if anyone had posted the big grails. No, I've not, not seen, seen anyone anything. yet. People kind of kick it hush hush, I think, when they get a big one. Yeah. But I mean, it would have been amazing to pull one of those. You've got to be in it to win it. It is a mystery box, so that is why. Much more videos, unboxing, mystery boxes, Comic Cons, toy hunting's coming back really soon as well. Comic Cons, the Kabu. I hope you're as excited as I am. Not for the early morning. <laughs> yeah, same. That's the only bad thing, the early morning's toy hunting at the car boot. But it is worth it, definitely worth it. If you want to see more of our videos, you should subscribe and hit the notification bell and you will see when they come online. Oh yes. Massively helps with the channel's algorithm, guys, whatever that even means. Thanks so much for your support. We are gaining subscribers more and more so that is absolutely awesome thanks for taking the time to watch our videos as well massively appreciate it and if you hit the like and give us a comment on which pop you like uh, we will reply to every single comment so from me dambo demise and me best demise be awesome be geeky be excellent to each other and we will see you again soon